The death toll from the devastating floods in South Africa rose to 395 on Friday, mainly the Durban region on the country's east coast. Police, army, and volunteer rescuers on Friday widened the search for dozens still missing five days after more than 340 people died in the deadliest storm to strike Durban. The unprecedented floods left a trail of destruction. Travis Trower, a director for the volunteer-run organization Rescue South Africa, said his teams had found only corpses after following up 85 calls on Thursday. Meanwhile, volunteers with hand gloves and trash bags fanned across the city's beaches to pick up debris left by the massive storms ahead of an unexpected surge of Easter weekend holiday makers. Well, if you think about it, at the moment we've got such devastation with plastics and that in our oceans. We're basically killing our oceans, and if we don't look after the oceans, we won't have a beach to appreciate in future years to come, and neither will our children. So it's important that people are educated, get the plastics out of the beach, stop the microplastics in the, in the, in the sea and the pollution that's killing off our oceans. Look, the task, is, it's a mammoth task. Um, it's a long way to go, but as you can see by the number of people we have around us here, they're all banded together. This is just one beach of three other beach cleanups going on concurrently. We have more news coming up after.